What's up, guys? Jarv here, back today, jumping into Destiny. It's Friday, and these geezers have only gone and found this guy, Zer, over on Nessus. You'll find him over in the Watch's grave by the Proving Ground strike. All right, let's see what goodies he's got in store today. So we've got the good old Darcy here. Shows critical information in scope. And a quiet taste this. 29 shards if you want it. We've got the young Amankara Spine. 63, so pretty low ability damage grants enhanced trip mines, which catch people out, especially me, in Crucible for 23 shards. We've got the feedback fences. Also 23 shards. These are 65 though, with 19 on recovery and 18 on strength. The melee hits store explosive defensive energy. Uh, then we have Apotheosis Veil, 65 with a juicy 29 on recovery. Look at that. Ability energy on supercast alloys get class energy. Literally nobody uses this. Although if it is Crota next season, then the immediate health regen might be a bonus to you because your health doesn't regen in the Crota fight. So just bear that in mind if you're a Warlock. If you don't have a good one, it might actually be worth pick picking it up. Then for the legendary weapons, then we've got Whispering Slab with Archer's Tempo Swash, the Grid Skipper with Killing Wind Snapshot, the Enigma's Draw with Grave Robber Swashbuckler. Another bow. We've got Trip Wire Canary here. Float, Perfect Float and Opening Shot. The Icolos Sniper with No Distractions Box Breathing. We've also got Rasputin's Arsenal there as the Origin Trait. The Recurrent Impact from Risen. Uh, we've got Headstone and Firmly Planted and Land Tank. That might be a spicy LMG if you want a Stasis one at least. And then we've got the Gnawing Hunger with Autoloading Holster and a Multi-Kill Clip. So nothing particularly godly there, but... Shout off down in the comments if you are picking any up. Then for the rest of the armor, we've got the Risen armor here. Um, oh dear, 53, 48, oh my gosh. Uh, 51 and a 50. So yeah, Zer's broken again, basically. <laughs> Low stats across the board and no god rolls, unfortunate. And then we've got the Hawk Moon with moving target again. He literally can't shift this three weeks in a row. Uh, got smooth grip, alloy mag and extended barrel. And then the DMT with fourth times a charm. At least it's half decent. But not with light mag. Oh dear. Hand laid stock. And our head break. Oh well. Zer tried. He turned up at least. There we go. He's available on Nessus if you want to check him out. Good luck if you're jumping into trials as well. It's the last trials of season 21. So good luck if you're chasing that trials cosmetics. But yeah. Stay awesome. Stay safe. I'll catch you for the showcase on Tuesday. And I'll see you all again very soon.